Welcome to Legacy Podcast. My name is Forever, and today's date is May 10th. Hello, my name is Madison from Class 801. Um, today's weather is pretty cloudy with a chance of meatballs. And fun fact, oh. we're all about to graduate soon. Yeah, well. Big 8th graders. Yeah. So, what's the topic about? Today is bullying and the effects of bullying, basically. Yeah. Um, I would like to introduce our guests. Would if y'all want to introduce yourselves, y'all can. Um, I'll go. Louder into the My mic. name is Adonis, and I'm from Class 601. My name My name is Adonis, and I'm from Class 601 of Legacy School of the Arts. Um, my name is Holly from Class 802 from Legacy School of the Arts. Um, so basically, what do y'all think about bullying and like what effects it can have on people? Um, I'm going to comment on that. Um, I feel like bullying is unnecessary because how are you going to talk on somebody, especially undercover? How are you going to talk on somebody, but you can't say it to their face? I'd rather you show your true facts than say it to someone's face. Amen, my brothers. Where's the questions? I don't really like the, um the topic about bullying like bullying i just feel like it's very unnecessary and i'm glad that in some other countries or continents or states they don't really do bullying there but in america especially new york there's a lot of bullying and i don't really like that so yeah um the concept of bullying is i don't like it but sometimes you really need bullying so people can figure out who they are because sometimes people don't know who they are without somebody telling them who they are. Um, all right, is there any experience with bullying? And I will answer that, obviously. But I've had experiences in elementary school with kids that would like comment on my body or what I wear, even though I didn't even look that bad. It was school uniform. And then when I got to Legacy in sixth grade, it was a lot of comments on my body again then. You know, at first I would be offended, but then now I'm in eighth grade. Mostly I would try to like brush it off, especially when people say it's a joke, when it's obviously not a joke, but yeah. Oh yeah, how did you like get over that? Um, I just tried to like, most of the time I would get mad, but I would like try to laugh it off or brush it off because I know that not all the time I can get upset. Cause what am I gonna do if they're just gonna keep saying the same thing? So yeah. Um. My experience with bullying is like, like in the um, fourth grade, I believe. Like I just, like in elementary school, I just didn't really like, I don't think, I felt like people didn't re like me as much. That's why they like bully me and stuff like that. I just get a lot of mean comments about like my race, my, um, facial, my facial features. And it just made me like insecure about myself until like the sixth grade. No, the seventh grade. Um, my experiences with bullying is I just wanted to brush it off because all throughout my years of being in school, people have been telling me that I'm too skinny to have to put some meat on my bones. And I've just dealt with it because I knew that people weren't gonna stop saying it. So I just wanted to brush it off and deal with it. Oh, uh, for me, it's like all the way from elementary school to here. Like, honestly, to me, bullying is a very deep topic. And I really don't think that most people want to stop. Like if someone said, we need to stop bullying, people are going to say, yeah, yeah. But then at, behind closed doors, they're just going to keep bullying. Like on anti-bullying day, I got bullied. Like, um, um, yeah, so we're going to continue this um, in the next show. So... Bye, everybody. Stay tuned, child. We're going to be back next week. <laughs> and cut. Bye. Peace out, child. <laughs>